Welcome back. And we have Myro, whose real name is Ogene Myro Daniel Oza. He's a multi-talented and versatile singer, songwriter, rapper, born in inner city at Jigule. You forgot one of uh, uh, one of the things he does. Mm -hmm. Versatile singer, songwriter, mm -hmm. rapper, rapper, and t-shirt maker. T-shirt maker. T-shirt t-shirt designer. <laughs> Good to have you here. It's a pleasure. Okay, so T-shirt. Yes. And, uh, okay, you are a graduate of architecture. Yes. T-shirt. Yes. Songwriting. Yes. Please, connect, connect them. <laughs> connect the dots. Okay, um, maybe I'll just, take, I'll just take us back a little bit. When we had um, the likes of Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo, these were people that had um, a flair for the arts. And there's a center. The center is the arts. So other things, um, the, the elements revolve around the arts. So... Beat architecture, design, music, they it's all, all art. Yes, it's all art. Architecture is termed frozen music, actually. So um, I just believe they all have, or they all need your creative um, input. And since I've been able to master them properly, I don't want to be in a box, you know, so that's why I just went all out on, on my talents. Okay, so there's architecture, there's songwriting and singing. What other part of the arts are you hoping to incorporate into this whole world? Well, uh, for now, I think <laughs> it's enough. <laughs> oh, yeah, enough. Okay. It's enough so. <laughs> okay, it, 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 there's enough on your plate. Now, yes. let's, let's look at who Organe Myro Daniel is. Okay. Um, right now, I'm an artist. That has been my love for a very long time. I think um, my love for music drove me to learn how to do t-shirts so I could make money for my studio sessions. So it happened that the t-shirts became quite big, and I made some money off it. You made some money, okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll come back and talk more about, about you, about your music, and of course, about the t-shirt. Just okay. stay with us. Okay, welcome back. Okay, you were telling us about who Myro, Organe Myro is. What yeah. to know about your background? Um, I was born in a chicken layer. Um, regular Nigerian family, when I say regular, the basics, they, you know, um, my parents placed priority on education, um, so I had to study really hard, and growing up, my mom was like, you have to come back as first position, so I was always that guy that was, you know, trying to be the best in my class, all through, I had a scholarship, um, I attended Abyssin on a scholarship, that's high school, um, Abyssin International Abyssin. School, okay. and I graduated top of my college, in my class, 4.47. So it was just, um, it was all about <clears throat> being the top in whatever you do. So I think that has greatly influenced me in everything that I've, that I've done so far. In merchandising and t-shirts, I designed the album for Fido, which is currently the highest selling um, artist merchandise in Nigeria right now, the most popular. So I think I'm just um, driven by those things that I, that I grew up with, basically. Mm, okay. So how when did music come in? Okay. Well, it's, uh, I don't sound cliche, <laughs> but... Since I was a child, I just had the thing for, for music way back. It used to be Shabba Ranks. It used to be, I was little, it used to be Blackie. You know, there used to be Shannon Peters and all that. Mm -hmm. So I just, I just knew that and was then, my part. And then Jimmy Shalanke is... Yeah, Jimmy Shalanke, yes. When I was so little... So how did I you bring all this together? Yeah. When I was, Ranks. Yeah. You see, um, good music doesn't have to depend on the genre. When you hear good sound, you hear good beats and lyrics then you could good flow. sound is good sound it is stop. yeah it is mm, okay <laughs> now after studying architecture and you chose music what did your parents have to say about that uh well my mom <laughs> my mom cried but i think oh, so far she's oh, she cried yes yeah, she did oh, but so you. far i think she's come to terms with it it's about love about passion and what you really want to do with yourself there have been people who've actually um, gone professional in some ways and had to form their talents. We've had likes of LD, who actually did architecture too. He's, he's done very well in music. He's come out with a beautiful app right now, the Play Data Chats. We've had the Proceed. There's just so many people who have actually done the same thing, but it's about following your passion and your, and your heart. I was looking at your video, you know, just before you came on then. I think the music is playing in the background now, and I see, you know, uh, maybe for in a long time, I see ladies in the video wearing something covering them up. Yes. And so, was that deliberate or is that just style? Uh, well, because most of the music <laughs> videos you see <laughs> the ladies wearing, you know, 
almost something next to nothing. Yeah, I try to bring a lot of uh, moderation to, me, to everything I do, and considering my, my background, my upbringing, my education, I just put those factors into everything I do, in my music, in my visual presentation, so that is how I term, that is how I roll my music. Is your family religious? Yes, they are. Okay. Yes, they are. I suppose that, that, that about covers it all, right? <laughs> okay, but, but, but I'm, I, I, does your mommy like this earring you have on you? That's my style. Okay. So uh, that's my style. Okay. Okay. Good. And artists normally, they, 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 artists are allowed to wear all kinds to, of to crazy little, things. To be a little liberal. Liberal. Yeah. Well, <laughs> and, and maybe eccentric sometimes. Yes, yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> so what's your experience so far, you know, in music? Um, it's it's been good. Definitely, there've been, been bad days, but I think the bad days as lessons. Then they've been very. When, when is a bad day? A bad day is probably going somewhere. And you have to go through a lot of protocols to get something that is very little to be done, you know. And you know, actually, it is something that may not deserve or or um, need the protocol, but because of certain reasons, you know, um, having shows, going to shows where um, you have to prepare, and you're there, and there are reasons why the show cannot go on, you know. So, but like I said, there are lessons for other days. Then the good days are there when you on stage and you're performing and the crowd goes berserk. They love your sound. They're singing your music word for word. They're responding. Those are like the greatest of days. Mm. So yeah, so I've had such experiences and those moments propel you to want to give more. To, to they, they tell you you're on the right path basically because it's one thing to do a lot of promotion. Then it's a spiritual thing for your song to be accept, accept, accepted. Really? Out. Yes, it is. So it there's is. a spiritual there connection is. there. Music is spiritual, trust me. Mm. It is. So I've been at a show where I hadn't been to the place for like my entire life and I was singing and they were responding. It was just a wonderful experience. I almost cried. So <laughs> those days come. So how long have you been singing? Professionally. Um, professionally, three years. I got signed in um, 2014 to Masterpiece Entertainment. So that's my co-professional book. Prior to then, um, the regular talent hunts, trying to hone the skills, school shows. So it's been a while. Okay, so now that you decide to be a, a songwriter, a, a singer, and you see that it will seem like there's a proliferation of everybody seem to be singing. Yeah. You know, and making up videos. Yeah. You know, what do you think about the, the industry? Right. First off, I don't think everybody's singing. I just believe because there's media presence on music. Um, we've had, well, every year we have numbers of graduates from School of Law, Medicine, Banking, as other fields, as music. But I think why people think musicians are more is because of the, the media presence. Mm. And no two artists sound alike, and I think everybody has, has a place in, in the industry. Just um, um, take your path and develop your path. That's what okay. I live by. Okay, so it's, it's been nice having you here this Same morning. Here. Thank you so much for, for sharing your time and of course... Oh, and then my road. Oh, and then my road, Daniel Oza. Yes. Thank you so much it's for a being pleasure. here. So that's Sunrise for today. We'll bring you a fresh package next time. I am Alero Idu, wishing you a very happy weekend and a blessed week ahead. Thank you so much for your company. I'm Yomi Otaibi. Do enjoy the rest of your day.